in the heart of America where the mighty Mississippi River meanders through 10 states, a tale unfolds that shatters the perception of sharks confined solely to the ocean. It all begins with a mysterious sighting deep within the murky waters of this iconic river. The Mississippi, renowned for its silt-laden currents, holds secrets beneath the surface. While we often associate sharks with the vast sea, some, like the remarkable bull shark, have ventured into these inland waters, defying conventional wisdom. Encounters with freshwater sharks are rare, but intriguing, igniting the imagination of those who hear them. Among these river dwellers, the bull shark takes center stage. What makes them extraordinary is their adaptability, thriving in both freshwater and saltwater realms. Historical accounts substantiate the presence of sharks in the Mississippi River. In 1937, a five-foot bull shark was reeled in near Alton, Illinois. That's according to records from the Illinois Natural History Survey. While sporadic sightings have occurred further downstream near New Orleans, the river does not host a thriving shark population. Apart from bull sharks, other species like the Atlantic sharp-nosed shark and the colossal whale shark have also made appearances. A peculiar feature set of the bull-nosed shark, apart from its marine counterparts, is that it has a gland that allows it to control its body's salt levels. You see, bull sharks exhibit this astonishing trait, the ability to navigate estuaries, traverse freshwater systems, and regulate the salinity inside their bodies. In the eyes of many scientists, the bull shark reigns supreme as the world's most dangerous shark. They are found across the globe. These apex predators favor shallow coastal areas, the very places where people swim day and night. Bull sharks, they can reach a length of 7 to 11 feet long, tipping the scales at 200 to 500 pounds. Their name bears witness to their aggressive disposition. And what sets the bull shark apart is their unique capacity to endure extended freshwater forays. Shark attacks typically involve three different species, bull sharks, great white sharks, and tiger sharks. Despite the cover art for this podcast today, great white sharks have not been found in the Mississippi River. These are Interesting Things with J.C.